up everybody? NJ Bike Life here. Uh, back on the bike. It's been quite a while. It's finally a nice day out. I think uh, today, tomorrow, and the next day are all supposed to be pretty nice days, so. Try and go out all three days and get a couple vlogs in. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry I haven't been able to make too many vlogs, but it's just been really, really cold. And uh, I'm just really lazy. I'd rather sit around and do nothing than go out when it's like... I want to say like the warmest day was probably like 22 degrees. It snowed, as you can tell, it snowed all this uh, a couple days ago. Probably like two days ago. And yesterday it rained, so you see a lot of it's like off of the... Uh, sidewalks and stuff, but a lot of it, uh, yeah, a lot of it froze because it was snowing, but now that it's not snowing, I had to come out and do a vlog, at least one, I haven't in a while, but I've just been, like, way too lazy, like, I haven't been able to bicycle in a while either. been able to do much other than go to work and play video games. I play this game called League of Legends. Uh, if any of you guys play it, I'll leave my summoner name on the, in the description and you guys can add me, I'll play. I've been playing a lot of that since it's been so cold. That and eating a lot. I think I gained like 20 pounds this winter, which I'm cool with because it keeps me a lot warmer the more weight I, I gain. I'm okay with that. I lose it all in the summer. I do a lot of biking and gymnastics and stuff. So it'll come right off. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I've been doing. I do a lot of photography too, and, uh, this winter I haven't even been able to get out and really get some, you know, any photos, which kind of sucks. But,. Yeah, it's a nice day finally. So, I'm out enjoying this beautiful weather. I'm gonna ride around a bit, get a feel. Do the bike again before I go on the main roads and stuff. Forgetting to put my blinker off. It's not looking good. But, uh, yeah. I've been seeing there hasn't been much moto vlogs online anyway. So that means a lot of people are starting to feel the cold. A lot of people haven't been making moto vlogs and stuff like that. So at least I'm not the only one. Which is good. It's always a good thing. I gotta, here in New Jersey too, like, I don't really want to ride on any, like, back roads and stuff like that, because there's so many potholes in New Jersey, like, right now, because of all the snow and all the plowing and stuff like that, so there's just, like, massive amounts of potholes, and, uh, the state actually said that they would start reimbursing people that were affected by, like, potholes and things, because of how, like, how bad it's gotten. Like, look, these things were just patched up. That's got, that's a pretty serious pothole. That could mess up someone's day. But the state was saying that they were gonna start reimbursing people because of the delay. Some towns didn't even have like salt and stuff like that. I know like Jersey City didn't even have salt to put down on the roads when it snowed. So it's just like a huge combination of like a bunch of different things that have been leading me not to be out on the bike just for safety reasons, not so much so I can't really stand the cold because I've been out when it's like freezing, freezing cold. But like, I don't know, I'd just rather not risk it, you know? Stay nice and warm in my little home with my video games and not have to worry about anything. But, like I said, today's gonna be nice, tomorrow's gonna be nice. So I'm gonna probably be, damn. 
probably be out doing a couple moto vlogs for you guys because I, I know I haven't in a while. Uh, an update to the bike. The last time I went riding was a couple Sundays ago, probably two, two or three Sundays ago. And the first thing I did the second I got on the trail, because the trail was still covered in snow, but it was really, really warm out, but the trail was still in snow, is when we were riding on like the fire exits and stuff, or the fire, uh, the fire roads to get to the trails, to get to like the, to the single tracks and stuff, I, uh, I fell right on like the first turn. So, I don't know how to ride in the snow. I'm gonna have to like practice a lot more and figure out like how to ride because, I mean, here it's gonna snow a bunch. I don't have snow tires, but I see like this dude, Kenny, with a bunch of numbers after his name. He'll be riding through the neighborhoods and he'll, uh, he'll ride on the snow like perfectly fine, like it's no big deal. And you got me who like barely is able to like give it gas in the snow and I like fall but yeah that was the last time I rode, I rode and uh I had just put some like brand used brand new used tires on I had got some used tires from a guy that we ride with and uh he never rode on the street with them they were mainly just on the road and I guess he wanted to like try different tires or something so he let me use I mean he let me take his old tires off his bike so I was using those and that still didn't even help. So, nah. Now I got new tires and I can tell just by riding that it's like a pretty big difference on how much uh, like support and stuff I get with the ground and the, uh, the grip and things like that. It's the same tires that I had. It's a Dunlop D606s, both front and rear. But it's just like, they're just newer, so. It, it, you can definitely tell the difference between like a ball used tire from like the old, I mean the newer tire. But it feels good man, it feels nice to be out back on the bike. Even though I don't even like remember how to ride, like my shifting is all ugly and stuff. So, I don't know. But I like it. Uh, still gonna be riding. All right, slowest car in the world. This road usually gets pretty bad when it comes to like um, potholes. That's probably why that lady was driving so slow. Yeah, you can just see it like that. She was just annihilated. These things are like massive. Look right here is like a massive asshole. So, I mean, in the state of New Jersey, they say if you get a pothole, you can actually file a claim like a, and uh, don't reimburse you for it. Well, I mean, people have done it, but I don't know how many people actually got reimbursed for it yet. But that's what they're saying they'll do. So, but yeah, how's how's everyone doing? I haven't, you know, been moto vlogging, so I'm kind of like disconnected. I'll still watch a couple videos. Like I watch, oh, I seen this girl on the way here. I watched like Chase and maybe had a couple videos and uh, what's his face, uh, like Jake the Garter Snake and stuff. They all had a couple videos, but I feel like they go a little bit harder in the paint than I do. But they're also, you know, in Texas and I guess Atlanta is where Chase is at. jacket on, put the Kevlar pants on, and then come out. It's been too long. I tried
tried to uh, tried to get a couple of riders, like uh, this one dude I know in Night City and on, on YouTube. I tried to get him to come ride with me, but he's over in school right now. He's like three hours away, so I tell him just ignore that and we'll, we'll go some other time. But I, I'm curious, like, how many people are actually in New Jersey that are close to, let's say, Monmouth and Ocean County? that would actually be interested in meeting up and going for a ride and like I mean I don't know what we would do but I'd be down to do like a meet up just to get to meet a couple of new people that ride and you know things like that if that's something you guys would be interested in just you know let me know and I'll see if what I can do to set something like that up because I think that would be pretty cool I would love to do a meet up and ride with a bunch of people now on like the Sundays when we go riding in the woods, uh, there's a lot of people that have recently joined up. There's like, now we used to ride with like six people or something like that. Now there's like a solid uh, like 12. I think the last time we ride we had like 14. So we're getting some pretty big groups going on. So I'd like to, you know, see people that are either want to ride on the dirt or want to ride on the street I'm down for for either one if, if, if that would be possible I'd be so cool with that that's a big truck but if that's something you guys would be interested in just let me know and I'll see what I can do about making it happen the roads don't look that bad though a lot of people are talking about how they're uh, this truck's massive Oh, that's cool. Look at that blinker. That's pretty cool blinker. It actually like, points to the arrow like those old uh, like Mustangs did. Or not the old ones. I think they're like the new ones. I've seen a recent rise in my subscribers too. I went from like 50 something subs to I'm almost at like I think I'm at like 70 subscribers right now so that was pretty cool that was nice to see uh, for all my new subscribers I really appreciate you subscribing and and if you guys ever have like content or you have questions or anything like that please don't hesitate to look to ask them because I'm, I'm here for you guys you know I'm, I'm, I ride with the helmet, I ride with the microphone and everything anyway, but if there's something that you guys want to see, like, I'll aim more vlogs towards that to accommodate you, just because I'm going to be doing it anyway, so it's not like a hassle to me, I, I want to help people, I want to help new riders or people looking to ride that might feel intimidated and might have questions, <coughs> I like to help you guys out however I can. And if I could do that by, by uh, you know, making a couple videos, I'd be more than happy to do that because that's what I'm here for. All these people running today. It must be good weather to run. She waved to me. What a nice lady. She wants to D. Dirt bikes get, get the girls. I don't know. I don't care what they say about street bikes and stuff, man. It's really... Just the dirt scooters that get the girls. Yeah. 